You know, Eric Musselman not leaving it, though, to stats and probability. He's going to have his guys ready to get after it. He knows that J.D. Note and Jalen Williams are going to be big keys for success. But a guy who has come along down the stretch is Stanley Amude. He scored in double figures in five of the last six games. He made the decision to be a Razorback for his final season of eligibility, and he's making the most of it. With more, here's C.J. Macklin. We were outside every single day, coming back at night, like late at night, just smelling like straight outside. I remember my mom always being like, go take a shower. You smell like outside, but, but no, that's really, I mean, that's where I got the love for the game. 6'6 senior forward Stanley Amude still remembers the days of playing basketball outside all day and night as a kid. Now he plays for the Arkansas Razorbacks inside collegiate arenas across the country. After four seasons at South Dakota, Amude was seeing success on the court, averaging 20 points a game, but he wanted more out of his final year of eligibility than just stats. You know, watching Arkansas in the, in the tournament last year while being at South Dakota it was big, you know, seeing how much fun they were having while they were winning and, and um, you know, seeing the way Coach Muss had the guys playing, it, it was just, it was inspiring for me and I felt like I could see myself, you know, playing in this environment. Amude said he reached out to Coach Muss right after that Elite Eight run and the rest is history. Amude is the second leading scorer for the Razorbacks and earned his spot in that starting lineup late in the season. That's Mamba mentality, a quote that one of his favorite players in the NBA taught him by just watching him play. Kobe Bryant was really the first player I started watching, so um, he was the first game I watched. It was a Kobe game, and, and I think I just fell in love with his mindset and you know how how he was able to perfect the game, you know, like just with his work with with his work ethic. So he was a he was a big reason why I started playing. This is Amude's last college season. What will he miss the most about playing in Bud Walton Arena? I'm gonna miss it all, you know. I'm gonna miss, you know, the pregame warm-ups to the post-game interviews, everything. You know, it's just the the feel. It's just it's 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 different, you know, him, Bud Walton, especially now, you know, with COVID over, the the arena sold out. Those last four home games, you know, Auburn, uh, Tennessee, Kentucky, and LSU, they were they were crazy. I'm never gonna forget. Yeah, those are crazy experiences, uh, you know. So I'll never forget those games, and and you know, I'm, I'm happy I got to play well in that last game and we were able to get the win. The Razorbacks have taken down all four of those opponents back at Bud Walton Arena. They need that same energy from the fans on the road when the NCAA tournament tips off.